Hi, this is Phil Monkhouse. Um, checking in on the um, some of the cities in Fort Bend County. Um, I left Katie off this list. I'm sorry if the fans in Katie and would like that info, but um, just looking at Sugarland, Missouri City, uh, Richmond, and Fulshire right now. Um, so Sugarland, uh, third week I've been tracking these numbers. The number of active properties in Sugarland is pretty much steady at 609. Um, pending properties is uh, down this week. 18 to 148 and s since the first week that I started tracking down 42 so that's a pretty big drop um less homes under contract means the, I'd have to say the market's slowing down that's a, definitely an indicator of that the number that actually closed is um it was at 28 which is up eight from last week and that's the same number that closed um in the uh, first week I started tracking 28 in Missouri City the number of active properties dropped two and um it's actually down 17 from the first week I started tracking to 484. Uh, the number of pending properties is down 29 to 226. So not as bad as Sugarland. Um, and the, about the same for the first week. Number of sold is at 27, which is down six um, from the first week, but that's actually up four from, or sorry, down six from the second week, but down, up four from the first week. So pretty much steady there. Uh, pending is dropping a bit, it looks like, so that's not great um, unless active falls to falls to match it. Uh, Richmond is um, active properties up 33 to 850, pending down 64 to 438. So again, it's dropping like um, more like Sugarland. And the number of sold is at 65, which is actually a pretty big jump from the previous two weeks I I track. So that that's good to see. People are going through with the purchase and closing the homes. Full shear, um, up eight to 330, 346 active homes. That's about steady from the first week. Uh, pending is at um, 140, which is down 14 um, from last week and 21 from the first week. And then the number of sold is 16, which is up one from last week. And um, up three from the first week, so so that's good. People are going through with the purchases, but um, I guess for all those cities, yeah, across all those cities, the number of pending homes are going down, the number that are um, um, under contract are dropping, and the number of active properties are, um, well, some are dropping, some are going up, but the pending properties are definitely outpacing the uh, number of active properties, so definitely a sign of a slowdown right now we're not supposed to be showing homes or sorry now we're allowed to show homes in Fort Bend County um, I don't think most people with an occupied home are not showing it it's all virtual tours right now um, maybe a FaceTime showing if someone's really serious um, unless it's vacant vacant it's a little different we can let people in the house um, there's a strategy where people kind of bring Clorox wipes with them open the door stand back maybe even wait in their car let the buyers walk through and then close up afterwards. So totally different right now. Um, there's de definitely still people that need to move uh, or sell their homes. So yeah, that's where we're at. Thanks for watching.